cruising down the street in my 6 foe. So what is up and what is percolating party people? As you can see, it is your host of the most, Paul Kent, who coming at you guys once again with another escapade of an adventure. I am once again going to hit up a booty load of thrift stores on this beautiful uh, Monday afternoon slash Tuesday because this is going to be a split up montage of a video. I don't really want to go all out and hit up like a thousand thrift stores today because I got ish to do. Just dropping off that package and uh, jamon. First destination, uh, once again, Trill Wheel, Goodwill store in Donation Central. We're about to go in here and see what they got. Uh, you guys see all the flicks they got? Ooh, which one will I get into tonight? But yeah, man, the first thing I saw was this uh, World Series shirt right here with all these weird like MLB logos and ish all on it, Hawaiian style, you know what it is. Going straight up Vice City on them boys. Cop or not, that high fashion uh, black suede hat? Huh? Get your rodeo on, cause we got some boots in the house, straight up Texas tradition. You know what it is. These are actually kind of dope. I say the size nine and a half or some bullshit. That St. Petersburg all over print little bucket hat thing, fedora in the building. You know what it is. A hey, goodwill just straight up fooled my ass. I was like, oh, Tony Parker jersey, ten bucks. Hell yeah, I'll cop that. Turn it around. It says Spurs on the back, number nine. Why the hell doesn't that say Parker right there? Come on, bruh, bruh. My boy Stewart left the Texas jacket in the mix. Sick colorway Houston Astros old school colors slash new school colors promotional jersey child genius crying or the zero zero starter heat or no nah? no nah, this is when starter fell out Mariners jersey embroidered Zo MG Fubu times NBA you joking me you got the NBA slash Fubu authentic warm up in the Lakers colorway Zam Zaddy them silk Australian draws though straight up fire mates where is my stapler where is my red stapler <laughs> bruh can you imagine if your parents did this bullshit like boy clean your room before I bite your motherfucking neck she is so sexy aspiring youtubers come to thrift stores to get your tripods for real though I always see these at thrift stores I told y'all get y'all's tripod game up aspiring youtubers get y'all's tripod game up dude this is what crack does to a wizard so they don't got that Oregon Trail type rustic ass slab in the building. Look at that straight up flatbed in the mix. So yeah, once again, they didn't have anything. All right, this is some type of shit that a mother of three would not even notice. She just straight up pull up like, kids, sit y'all's asses down. We going to soccer practice. Not even see this little moped just straight up human in a freaking SUV. Like, <laughs> and then she just look at it and be like, fucking just drive off. Anyway, so yeah, Goodwill didn't have ish. Now I am going to um, head over to Savers. Ah, oh, so that boy Sean Paul ain't back on the radio. Let me go, Salen. Well, I don't really care. Dude, shout out to Sean Paul, though, man. That dude straight up inspired me to get braids again. So I'm gonna, you already know I'm going to get cornrows and shit. You guys already are like, you like riffraff, motherfucker. So, you know, I might as well get the zigzag Iversons in this bitch. Oh, snap. Y'all see that? Somebody start playing the Frank Ocean right now. Oh, hell no. This person better not take my spot. Oh, fuck no. They're about to get... Oh, hell no. Nah. You little bitch. You little motherfucking bitch. Yeah, that's why that person's in the spot. You little bitch. Damn, oh well, I gotta settle for less this time. Oh, hell no, I'm about to hop on hands with whoever that is. Just know, just know. Oh, it's this old lady, happy ass motherfucker. She took my spot in her dumb ass little firebird. Hell no, I'm about to slash them tires. Just know that shit with my pocket knife. Oh, hell no. I'm gonna show you guys who she is. I'm gonna chase her ass down. Oh, there she is right there, perpetrating the foul right there. Look at that, walking around like she's innocent, knowing she stole my spot. I'm gonna go up there and just take her hat and just start rocking and make a video about it. Um, mm Hey, but her outfit game is on point, though. <laughs> Alright, that's creepy enough. Hey, that Perlis Mardi Gras polo game shirt is on point. In this jersey section, we got a Cubs Authentic. $8.99 with the Cubs right there. Is the name on it. Oh, we got a Flyers jersey. Hey, this shit is dope. What else we got? So we got this Peyton Manning right here, six dollars, size medium, size small, NFL. This uh, Peppa's jersey right here, Nike. That Starbury jersey though, for the win. Uh. So like, still got that blackout and blue uh, Fubu. But look at this wannabe, this New York brand faded double zero. Oh hell no, they straight biting off you Fubu. Things will never be the same. Badass hockey jersey department. We got that sweat number ninety nine, sweat. Dude, so this Cubs jacket is straight up amazing, dude. Authentic right here, eight bucks. The material is like on point. The stitching is on point. The printing game is on point. Look at that little detail right there. Uh, it says Thermabase. Damn, huh? 
BJ is. Blowjob High School. Cutting so gone very wrong. Peep this Tommy Hilfiger multicolored straight up plaid XL golf shirt. Bruh, Tommy, you blind for him? Snapback game, non-existent, really. Well, they got the Stanley Cup champions, Blackhawks right there by Zypher. Not bad, UT little hat. And then nuts and L's, nuts and L's. So Sabres had nothing, NOTHING! So, uh, yeah, I was gonna just end the video here for today, but there actually is a little thrift store called Top Troll Thrift Store right up the road. So I'm just gonna pop in for a little second, and well, you know, we'll see if they have anything up in there. Hey, on the low, this is a badass truck, though. We at Top Troll Thrift Store. What the duck? Bruh. Scenery, scenery. Little hipstery, small little shop. Dude, check out this satin jacket. LaGrange, right there, all embroidered in the bread colorway. And it says LaGrange College right there. $8 size large. I'm copping this. In really good condition. The buttons are all still there. A little bit of yellowing, but shit, that makes it look even more badass and old. Top, for show. Dude, this jacket is fire, bruh. Look at that. Uh. That champion snapback though. Dude, <laughs> what? Dude, you cannot front. This is the most patriotic shirt ever. The Spirit of America T size medium, five bucks right there. Baby Air Jordans. That's an awesome freaking yeah, tag. I never, I never knew they even made those. The 14s. These are really cool. Don't mess with Texas bag. It's stuffed to the brim. Dude, that LaGrange jacket was fire. You guys already know I had to cop it. The customer service in there was on point. They had those baby little Jordan 14s, which were dope as hell. And what's even better is she gave me that jacket for half off. I don't know why. Maybe it was blue tag half off day. But all I know is I spent $4 on that really old school, straight up vintage LaGrange college baseball jacket. Still! So I'm at Buffalo Exchange and check this out, guys. They want $7.50 for this. Eddie George, it looks straight, right? Everything looks good. Check this shit out. Bruh. Like, what the fuck, bro? Oh my god. What is that, L2? You kidding me? Hey, they got some low key fire though. The Shaquille O'Neal Champion USA jersey right here. Dream Team jersey. They want 25. I think I might copy. It's my size, size 40. More flame. Jerry Rice. Boom. 49ers, white colorway. Starter. They want 30. Drill tank, 16 size medium. Crooks, 15. Tweety fire, look at that. More flame off stitched in. O'Neal number 7, Timberwolves, NBA, Adidas, Cowboys, Looney Tunes, Boom, Nets, all stitched in. Castle, number 10 right there, real dope, XO, they want it, 34. Hey, check these out kids, they got the denims in here for 34 bucks, size 10. These are dope as hell. OMFNG guys, I'm freaking pumped because I just copped two dope ass champion jerseys. Look at this Pippin jersey guys. This thing is straight up crispy as fuck. I got it for $17. And then I got the Shaquille O'Neal Team USA Dream Team jersey for 25 That's a lot more than I usually spend. However, I'm a fan of both of those players. Both of them are my size. And that Pippin one actually was like on hold. So I went up to the cashier and so I was like, hey, what's up, babe? What you doing? What you trying to do? No, I was like, dude, like, when did they put that on hold? And she's like, I'm not sure, but it gets off hold tonight at 9. So, like, I'll call you if it gets off hold, right? So another worker comes back and she's like, hey, who's this on hold for? And he's like, oh, it's it's on hold for Tiana. And then they were like, oh, well, Tiana works here. So if a customer wants it, then we have to sell it to a customer first. So that's how your boy ended up copping the Pippin jersey off Tiana. So Tiana, I'm really sorry, homegirl that works at Buffalo Exchange in Austin, Texas, but thank you, motherfucker. I got it. <laughs> it's in good hands. I swear to God. 
Yeah, so what is good, people? It is day two of this thrifting adventure right now. And so, yes, the next day I'm about to hit it hard once again. Those jerseys that I got were straight up bomb at Buffalo Exchange. And as you can see, I'm rocking one right now. Not one that I copped yesterday, but just a champion jersey in general. Because champion in the summertime is what it's all about. But now, let's get it and let's see if I can uh, come up with any more dope ass finds. Tuesday afternoon at Trip Town right now. We're going to see if they got anything up in the building. All right, we in here. Shoe department. We got some all black Chuck Taylors right there. Some starter little New Balance wannabes. But yeah, here's the scenery, guys. But straight up peep game at the Chester Cat motherfucker hat. Damn, got that pussy on my head though. But as usual, they don't have any other hats in this. But what they do still have is that dip dye fade to green to blue, that nice oceanic looking aqua fubu shirt in the mix. Hitting on the back while we found this nice all black corduroy Mickey Mouse little strap back thingy majigger. Not gonna cop this, they went three bucks. It's kinda dope, but I would never rock this. YKK zipper, zoom out, O M F ing G. Look at this burnt orange and black, University of Texas at Austin, the college I go to. Mother freaking Vosky jacket. So dope, but a little bit too expensive. But we bagged up it with, of course, the cheap little $3 custom Mother freaking Wolf Howling at the Moon, little Western, little jean jacket. Oh, M gosh, this thing is just too cute, girl. So, what's it in? It's in the game. Huh. Got them Tigger slippers. Mm, ferocious. A better, better, a better, better swing. You see that dope ass like a tiger head thing? I want that. And you see that USA like peace button thing? I want those. But ain't nobody over here to help be a boy. So who knows? I might just like break through this glass and run off of that tiger ass. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> uh, jumping out of thrift town. And what I got there, as you guys saw, were these little buttons. You know I had to get that USA apple because there is no fruit that is more patriotic than this here apple in the mix. Peace sign, $1.49 might be a bit too much for like six buttons or however many this is, but I think they're dope. Put them on some snapbacks or a jean jacket or some shit. The heist is about to happen. Real talk about a freaking rob them boys. Jack, I'm at Thrift Land right now. About to go in there. Dude, this car has been driving sporadically for like the last five minutes. They need to move their ass around, bruh. Smells like ass in here. Noteworthy hats they got in the mix is this uh, little minor league baseball one and this dead stock Ralph Lauren polo like strap back. They want 13 bucks for this. I ain't about it, so I ain't gonna get it. Dude, look at this Fila freaking flame right here. This like freaking primary color windbreaker Fila line Italy right there. Bruh, this thing is pretty damn sexy if you ask me. And you got this like American flag surf styles, like Cape Cod jacket. This thing is real dope. Pretty yellow though, but damn, I uh, oh, see in the jersey department we got some more Patriots jerseys. One, two, three, four, and five. They always got Boston crab up in here. But the best jersey in the building is this NFL Russell Authentic Athletic size 52. Number eight, Troy Aikman jersey for the Cowboys. The only downside. <laughs> oh my God, this bitch is still talking. Dude, we got the Bill Cosby sweater in the freaking vacuum water colorway. Look at that shit, man. And we got the Versace in the building. Check it out, ballers. They got some size 11 Tims for 13 bucks. Uh, so check me out. Got another pair of Tims. These are gonna be like my beater Tims that I'm gonna wear like probably every day in the winter slash like late fall. But yeah, man, Thrift Town came through in the clutch. Once again, got this American flag with this uh, balling bald eagle uh, tie for my dad. Hey, look at old dude in the red Ferrari. <laughs> that boy straight up jamming. What do you guys think he's listening to? Some like EDM type shit? Miley Cyrus, I don't even know. The world may never know. Zoom, zoom. What was good? So as you guys can see, I am back in the crib right now. So I'm going to get into the pickups straight up from this vid. The first thing we got is this Bulls number 33 champion size 40 Pippin jersey right here that I got at Buffalo Exchange. You guys know what it is. Then we got this USA basketball dream team number 13 Shaquille O'Neal size 40 as well. 
Boom. Then this dope-ass LaGrange bread colorway, LaGrange College Panthers right there. Look at that patch. Straight, ferocious, for real. Black hats on deck right here. Definitely will be rocking this a lot in the wintertime. Also, as you guys saw a couple seconds ago, got this here American flag tie, patriotic, American buttons, patriotic. Then last but certainly not least, damn, that jacket is nice. We got this. Timbaland wheat boot size 11. These probably fit like a 12 because Timbaland seem to run a size up. These are really sexy. Probably be my little beater boots that I wear all the time to the art building and to do woodworking and such. So really stoked about those. But yeah, guys, that's essentially everything I picked up in this trip to the thrift video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe as you guys always do. Here also the most, Paul Can too. Once again, signing out, saying peace and love. Stay thrifty and stay trippy. Ha! Peace!